Welcome back. I guess at this time, uh, this is a good moment to summarize what we have learned、uh, up to now. We introduced the discrete memoryless source right at the beginning. That basically is just a source where its output、uh, outputs are all IID random variables. Um, and we argue that、uh, for discrete memoryless source, each sample will contain the amount of information equal to the channel entropy H x. Um, so basically, uh. Okay, h x is given by the expectation minus log p x, or equal to summation p x log p x. Um. Then. We show that it's possible to construct a scheme that can compress the source actually at a rate exactly equal to the channel entropy, and this is done by taking advantage of the idea of typical sequences. Uh, basically, uh, we will just、uh, first construct a table containing all the typical sequences and give this table to both encoder and decoder, and at the encoder. When it receives a sequence, basically it will just look into the table and see which of the、uh, entry that contain that sequence, and then we output the index of the entry to the decoder. And at the decoder, it will simply recover the sequence for table lookup. So it's like we have this discrete memoryless source. We first like. Argue that the amount of information is equivalent to H X. Actually, start at the beginning. We kind of argue that by hand waving, and then、uh, we show kind of more rigorously that we can compress the source at the weight、uh, equal to、um, at the weight、uh, equal to H X. So in the sense that it's like building an upper bound of the amount of information. Upper bound equal to H x by construction by construction using idea of typical sequences. Finally. We show it just last time that、um, it's impossible to build any code that can compress the source lower at a rate smaller than the given by the channel entropy, or in the sense that it's really impossible to compress the source smaller than h x bits per sample. So therefore, we can really imagine that、uh, the amount of information of the source. Is at least h x bits per sample. Therefore, we really build a lower bound there also, like last time. No code can compress EMS or like just x at weight smaller than h x. Bits per sample, and this is、uh, used the idea of basically the main trick there is by using cross inequality. So this really completes our argument about like、uh, uh, about like stating that like the amount of information of a discrete memoryless source is simply. Equal to H X.